morning. morning. Well, my kids are starting school this week, so I thought, you know, there's such big things with the beginning of school. We've got big tasks in front of us, and some of us have big feelings, especially after a year of staying at home and distancing, and we have big expectations. So I thought, maybe Liam needs a new backpack. What do you think? Do you think it'll fit all the bigness of this school year? What do you think, Liam? Is it a good one? (laughs) Maybe a bit too big, he says. Well, new things can feel really big, and that's a good thing, but it can also sometimes be intimidating. But today, we want to celebrate the beginning of a big new school year for our students and for our teachers and for our school staff and administrators. And also just remember that we are all part of that big new thing too, that whatever God's given us to do every day is big and important. And so today we have the message that even when things seem really big and heavy, whether that's good and exciting, or whether that's a heavy weight on our backs, that like we're worried or stressed about something, that God has got our backs. And so today we have a gift for all the kids, whether you brought your backpacks or not, we have backpack tags that say, God's got your back. And it has the verse on the back that says, be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. And that's what God tells us in Joshua 1.9. And we have plenty of these so that not just kids, but grown-ups can take them as well and put them on something that you take for whatever kind of work you do. And it may be, for some of us, that for some people that might be um, a book bag or a pencil case. For some people it might be like a craft bag or something, but whatever you take that you work on. And then for people who don't carry a bag, we also have kind of like credit card ones that you could put in your wallet, right? Or you could use as a bookmark in a book that says God's got your back. Because you know what this means? It means two different things to me. One is that God says, Jesus said, come and follow me because my yoke is easy and my burden is light. And when he said that, a yoke is something that people would wear or animals would wear on their necks to pull something. And it didn't mean that that Jesus said that your life is going to be easy. But he meant God is with us and he is so strong that when he's with us, when we're on his team, he does the pulling. He does all of the work that needs that, that we can't do. So that even a heavy, heavy, heavy burden, we can pull it with God's help. And the other thing it means, God's got our back, is that we might be um, kind of thinking about what's ahead, but we might not be looking behind us. God's got your back means whatever's coming that you didn't expect, whether it's something hard at school, whether it's um, a person that you need help dealing with, something that you couldn't have thought of. God knows what's going to happen this year. God's got your back. God's looking out for you, and he has a plan for you for this year. So God's got your back with helping you carry your burdens, and God's got your back with looking out for you this whole year long, and that's something that we all need to know. So these tags remind us that God's with us. So let's Right now, we invited any kids that brought their backpacks with them that they could, we could bless them and pray over them. We're going to do that from our seats. So if your kids brought your backpacks, parents, you can lay your hands on those backpacks. Anybody who has something with you that you would take with you to work or to school, whether it's a phone maybe, or a wallet, or a notebook, or a pencil, or whatever, you can get that out right now and put your hands on it, and we're going to pray and bless it right now, okay? And if you didn't bring anything with you, that's okay. We can, you can put your card or your tag on it later and, and bless it later, okay? So let's pray. Dear God, God of fresh starts and new beginnings, we bring ourselves and our big feelings and our big backpacks to you. Last year was so different from what we expected, but you... Um, were with us as we struggled with different feelings and and different plans for last year. In our backpacks, we carry so many um, hopes for this year with those blank pages and sharpened pencils and pointy crayons. And in our hearts, we carry big feelings, questions, expectations, possibilities, who knows who we might meet, what we might do, what we might become. You know, God, that's who knows. God, you're our friend and you're always with us. 
So be with us as we drive or ride the bus to school, as we walk or as we stay home, as no matter what happens, where we are, you're with us. And however we get there, whatever we wear, we, you are with us blessing this journey. And thank you, God, for all of our teachers and helpers and caregivers and leaders and for all that they do to help us learn and grow. God, you're our friend and help us to have open minds and hearts to learn and to experience your wonder. And now, God, we bless these backpacks and book bags and briefcases and totes and diaper bags and whatever it is that students and teachers and workers are carrying with them. And we ask you to um, help these backpacks be full of hope and full of reminders of, uh, that you are with us and you have our back. In Jesus' name, amen. <laughs>